Hi, good morning. So today I will demonstrate to you how to get the vital signs of a livestock animal. These vital signs include the temperature, the pulse rate, and the respiration rate. Getting the vital signs of these animals are important because it helps us to determine their overall health. So if their vital signs are not normal or it is in an abnormal state, it is a cue for us as an owner to send them to a veterinarian. So let's proceed to the first vital sign. In getting the animal's temperature, we need a thermometer. And before we insert it in the animal's rectum, we need to lubricate it first using a gel or anything that is lubricant that will be applied on the tip of the thermometer and this will aid for the easy insertion in the animal's rectum. After 2-3 to three minutes, you may now remove the thermometer from the animal's rectum and read the temperature based from what is shown on the thermometer. So in getting the pulse rate, you may do it manually by touching it with your hand to the pulse of an animal or if a stethoscope is or if you have stethoscope available you may use it for easy determining the pulse of the animal so in measuring the pulse rate count the beats of an animal animal's pulse within 15 seconds and multiply it by 4 so that you will get the beats per minute of an animal Lastly, in getting the respiration rate, you just need to observe their breath on their nostrils. For some animals, you may determine it by touching their flank. So, in measuring the respiration rate, you just need to count the breath within 15 seconds and multiply it by 4 so that you may derive the breaths per minute of an animal. So that's all for today. I hope you learned something in getting the vital signs of your livestock animal. Since it is very essential to determine whether your livestock is healthy or not. So that's it. Bye-bye.